Yo, you guys are currently watching a Black Line production. I truly want to thank you guys for tuning in right now. And if you're new to the channel, I want to thank you for stopping by. But I want to give a huge thank you to everybody that came through in my last video, man. I made my much-weighted return back to this YouTube thing, man. I was going through a couple things, and I had to put this YouTube thing to the side for a minute for my family. And when I made that video, man, a lot of you guys showed a lot of love, man. I appreciate that. But right now, we're playing this Mad 16 in an online rain match and you guys already know i got my favorite squad in the whole wide world the baltimore ravens and i'm taking on the tennessee titans now in this gameplay right here man i just felt like my opponent was head and shoulders better than me and i'm usually a very confident person man never cocky just very confident in my abilities because i know what i'm capable of but in this game right here man my opponent was pushing me to my absolute limits man and i truly knew by you know his body language by his play calling that he was better than me so I definitely had to be on my A game if I want to pull out the victory as you guys see right now it's the first quarter minute and 47 seconds left to go it's third and eight my bonnet is looking downfield making all these kind of crazy reads but he took too long and the Ravens defense come through in the clutch like they do on this play right here man like I said before man I just felt like my opponent which just had a little bit more talent than me you know what I mean I mean, sometimes it be like that sometimes, you know, you can't be real prideful in them kind of things because when you usually find out, you know, someone's better than you, you know, you really stack yourself out, you know what I mean? So, like I said before, man, I'm usually a real confident person, but I definitely had to step my game up if I wanted to win this one. As you guys see on the screen, it is the second quarter, two minutes and 47 seconds left to go, and my opponent just converted the first down conversion, and now he has another first down, and he throws an INT to Kendrick Lewis, man. He had a difficult year with the Ravens organization last year. This was, that was his first year, but look at this play right here, man. I'm going to show you guys an instant replay right here, man. Joe Flacco to Rashad Perriman for the touchdown, man. If you're new to the channel, you're going to see that a lot in my videos, man. Joe Flacco's arm with Perriman's speed is a lethal combination. That's why I can't wait for the Ravens season next year. But yeah, man, like I said before, and I'm going to say it again over and over and over. I appreciate you guys showing all that love on my last video, man. I mean, because you guys don't know, my neighbor had a fire and we are impacted by it. So, you know, I had to put this YouTube thing to the side. And the good thing is, you know, what don't kill you make you stronger. And we're going to be stronger than another, my family and nah. I. But yeah, man, it's the second quarter, 16 seconds left to go. Get ready for this high time show. I'm going to get off the mic so you guys can enjoy it. And I'll see y'all after I get back. Thanks again for watching, y'all.
back, YouTube. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the halftime show, man. That was gameplay footage of SSX Tricky, man. That was one of the very few games that really played a huge impact on my childhood, man. No matter how many years has passed, I'll always remember how to play that game because I played that game so much. I definitely recommend it for all gamers of all ages. As you guys see, we get back to the game. It's the second quarter. Three minutes and ten seconds left to go. My opponent is looking downfield. He makes an incredible play. I'm going to have to rewind that so you guys can see it again, man. I done seen this footage like a thousand times, and I still can't believe my opponent was able to keep his feet in bounds. Look at that, man. That was amazing, man. When my opponent make plays like that, you got to respect it, man. You ain't got time to hate, man. You just got to do what you got to do and try to readjust and get back in good field position because my opponent definitely made a great play. But as you guys see, it's the fourth quarter, five minutes, 59 seconds up to go, and he puts even more points on the board, and now he has a one possession lead over me. I'm trying to make some good plays, and we hit our tight end, Crockett Gilmore, who had a really good season. He was banged up a little bit, but that happens to the best of us, man. You know, he's definitely one of the bright spots of the Ravens um, team last year. But as you guys see right there, man, we put the ball on the money, converting the first down, and now we have an extra set of downs, and then we run the screen pass. Justin Forsett, another really great player that plays for the Ravens organization, man. I got tons of respect for Justin Forsett, man. He's a phenomenal running back and even better person. But as you guys see right there, we're on the ball with Rashad Perriman. The rookie who didn't play for us next year, but who's going to make a huge impact this year. But look at this play right here, man. We going forward on fourth down, man. My opponent is just making me do it. Well, he ain't making me do it, but you know, you know, he, he I had to do it. It was almost like if I didn't do it, I was going to lose the game. So that's the reason why I did it. And now we score even more points. And now we have a one possession lead over my opponent this time. And now he's driving down the field. And I got to make a play. Otherwise, this game is over. But I truly want to thank you guys for tuning in right now. I really do appreciate it. Hopefully, you guys had a really good day. If you didn't, hopefully, it gets better tomorrow. And until next time, keep God in mind at all times. I'm the Black Lion. And I'm out.